um, continue working, uh, investing, kind of like really setting the money aside. Um, in the long run, I want to like live abroad, so possibly buy properties in Asia, Mexico, um, invest in businesses. I kind of want to open like a laundromat up. I'm kind of really wanting to just kind of get up like residual income. Okay. Um, that sort of thing, really. That's kind of like in the forefront and of course meet someone that I could kind of establish a relationship with and uh, start a family. Yeah. Okay. What would that look like in in the midst of all that? Because that seems like that's a lot for... I don't think it's too much. I think you're going to work and just, you know, money comes in time so you can mm -hmm. allocate finances and just do what you need to do and then meet that person and kind of build upon that and get to know them and, you know, go in the right direction that, you know, hopefully they're both, you both are on the same page. So, okay. yeah, that's kind of how I see it. Okay. Yeah. That's my question. All right. <laughs> okay. Any questions over here? Um, yes. Are you, how do you feel about long distance relationships or where are you, where do you live? I stay in LA right now, Los Angeles. Uh, I've never done a long. Um, I don't mean to be rude, but I don't think he mean residual income.